Hey up, Rock God 2004 back again with another video for you. Um, I've just got back from HMV, um, the dreaded one in Middlesbrough, uh, and I got two items. I got a Blu-ray and I got a 4K. Um, the Blu-ray is um, another Hammer film to add to my small but slightly growing collection. And I've been after this one for a while. Um, it was finding it with the slip and it had one. Um, so the one I got today was the reptile. I've only ever seen this once and I can't remember much about it. But I remember as a kid, my brother had one of those um, like graphic cartoon magazines which had the hammer films in, which I suppose were graphic at the time, for over a year anyway. And I remember seeing this in it and I used to read the story in it. And then on the back of the, the, the cover was like the a replica of the post of the artwork and this thing terrified me and I always wanted to see the film and then I remember watching it once on I think it was on YouTube Um I can't remember nothing about it but I thought I've got to get it to go with, like with me other hammer stuff really enjoying the hammer films at the minute mind Um yeah so you get that the side the side I'm hoping they stop doing this. I, I, I've been told that they're going to be. And then the cover's pretty much the same, really. Um, it's the same on the front, on the back. And then inside, you get the film on Blu ray and on DVD. So, pretty excited to watch it. Pretty excited to watch it. So I'm pretty excited to watch that one because I've been after that one for a while. So that's the Hammer One, the Reptile, and the 4K. Um, it's only come out this week, um, but I absolutely love this film. Always have done, um, and it's the 45th anniversary of Saturday Night Fever with a slip. Well, I'm on that. Um, this is what I actually went for. Um, and it was just on the half chance to see if they had it in. Because I wanted to make sure I got it with the slip. Um, and then when I was in there, I thought about the reptile. Went and had a look and it was there. So I thought, I'm having them. Um, I think that's, yeah, like a metallic flaw. If I could pick a fault, I would rather them have used the proper film poster. Yeah, he's like that. But with the proper flaw and with, um, is it... Lynn Gorney, I think they call the actress, in the background. The proper thing and the proper logo. But it's out. That's the main thing. Um, this is the name of the film on the side, but it's pretty sort of difficult, really, in the light because it's um, it's like a sort of silvery grey. And that... <laughs> We're stopping them. Lies! The 4K cover inside the slip case again identical. And you do actually get the Blu-ray. Um I don't know what edition this is, but I got a Blu-ray with it which was the director's cut in um the vinyl reissue box set. Um I mean dad got me from last Last present my dad ever got me on my 50th birthday. And the Blu-ray was in it and it was a director's cut. I don't know whether that is or whether it's just the theatrical cut. And then the 4K is there. So it's nothing really snazzy, but then I go, oh, that's... And again, sorry, that's paramount fear, isn't it? But I'm just glad that they've released it. And with a slip. Can't beat a bit of Saturday Night Fever. Um, also, Posty brought me uh, a seven-inch single, which I got pretty cheap for what it is. Uh, and I forgot about it because this took that long to come. Um, but in the 70s, um, there was a band. Some people class them as punk. I did. Some uh, others didn't. Now, I used to have this single, but not this edition. Uh, and it's the skids working for the Yankee dollar. 
I love that song. Looks in really good condition. But this one, I didn't even know it existed until years and years later. I never had this one. There was a limited edition where you got a free single with it, and it's their version of all the young dudes. Um, and it come in a a gatefold sleeve. I, I mean, this is the only one I've ever seen in the flesh of this. They even got the spine like they like, the would like a twelve inch record, which I thought was really good. So yeah, the centre and the folded out, and then the singles. And with the white virgin label which the skids actually used to use it quite a bit they did it um quite a bit they did it on um into the valley as well i was waiting for the yankee dollar and the b-side is vanguard's crusade which i don't remember how it goes but working for the yankee dollar i love it all the young dudes i've never heard their version which was written by david bowie look and the B-side of that is Hymns from a Haunted Ballroom, which sounds intriguing. So yeah, I'm glad to have that. I do have another um, few Skid singles, because I used to really like the Skids when I was a kid. I've got um, Into the Valley on White Vinyl. Um, oh God, it was an early single. So some of it was Suburbia in. I've got that on White Vinyl. I can't remember the name of it. I've got the very first single, which was called Charles, which was before they were even signed to Virgin. Um, I've got that with a picture sleeve uh, and I've got Masquerade as a double seven inch single. I think there's another one or two. I could be wrong there, but something that's telling me there might be another one or two where you, with like, where you get like bonus three singles. You need to hunt them down. Uh, yeah, so that's my little lot for the day. To, so I've got like a, a Blu-ray, a 4K and a seven inch single. Jolly good stuff, eh? And um, I've had a shipping notification as well. Um, I've got three Hammer films in the 3 for 20 on the way. And I can't wait for them to arrive. Um, I'll give you a little clue. More than a clue really, wasn't it? <laughs> But that's on the way. Can't wait to see that. I used to absolutely love that film when I was a kid because I could watch it without being overly scared. Um, so, yeah, I can't remember a thing about it now, only the fact that when I was a kid, absolutely loved it. So I am so excited for that to arrive. So, yeah, there you go. So thank you very much for watching my little offering for today, all two of you. I really, really do appreciate it. Um, and if you can recommend if you like in the comments if you let me know is there any hammer films that i should watch slash or get i've got all the christopher lee dracula ones and i've got um i've got the screen factory version of one with peter cushion called night creatures over here it's called captain clegg what a film that is uh, and i've got so i've got that i've got a box set of dvds but i would like to upgrade them to blu-ray but yeah if there's any really good Hammer films, give us a shout, let me know, and I'll see if I can hunt them down. Um, so, yes, I will see you very soon. I'm very windswept on the next one. Thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it, and I shall see you very soon. Take care.